Turkish-made Bayraktar TB2 drones have been a key asset for Ukraine's armed forces in the ongoing fight against invading Russian forces. The drone has a cult-like following. So popular are Bayraktar drones with the Ukrainian army that it's celebrated in a song. We took offense at those orcs. Russian bandits are made into ghosts by Bayraktar and posted on the country's land forces Facebook page. Now, Turkey has delivered another platform. The Ukrainian military has got an initial batch of 50 Kirpi vehicles from the country. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes how Turkish Kirpi armored vehicles could help Ukraine. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by NordVPN. Get an exclusive NordVPN deal by going to nordvpn.com slash defense or clicking the link in the description. Use the code DEFENSE at the checkout to get an extra month free for the two-year plan. It's risk-free with Nord's 30-day money-back guarantee. Kirpi means hedgehog in Turkish. It's produced by a company named BMC. This specific vehicle is primarily designed as a troop carrier which also provides a high level of protection against some heavy threats, including mines and ballistic rockets. It uses double armor, plus its underbody has a V-shape which reduces the impact of any ground-based explosive devices. Kirpi weighs 18 tons when empty, or 20 tons at a maximum payload. The transporter is powered by a 375 horsepower, 275 kilowatt engine and has an ABS brake system that comes as a standard. Driveline is completed by an Allison 3000 six-speed fully automatic transmission coupled to an Axletech two-speed transfer box with selectable 4x2 or 4x4 drive. The operational range of these trucks is also impressive. Approximately 1,000 kilometers or 620 miles can be driven at a speed of 60 kilometers per hour or 37 miles per hour. The truck can fit 13 people, including the driver. BMC Kirpi has five gun ports and two roof hatches. The personnel cabin and engine section are fitted with an automatic fire suppression system. The Kirpi is also equipped with a self-recovery winch, intercom system, shot fire location tracking system, and an automatic fire extinguishing system. However, the function of Kirpi is not limited to just carrying personnel because it can be easily equipped with different add-ons, depending on mission requirements. It can be fitted with an M2HB machine gun, MK19 automatic grenade launcher, and a remote-controlled weapon station. The first prototype of Kirpi was produced in 2009. Since then, this military vehicle received a number of upgrades. The latest iteration, Kirpi 2, has been introduced in 2018. It features a number of technological improvements and also subsystems specifically developed to increase not only its mission effectiveness but also better ride quality for occupants. Kirpi now has independent suspension, improved air conditioning, and an engine cooling pack. The passenger seats are also mine protected and the windows are bulletproof new composite add-on armor, a second armor layer which is used in addition to the standard armor, is lighter, which results in larger payload capacity while simultaneously providing improved protection against mines. The conflict between Ukraine and Russia is raging on even though many experts had predicted a quick Russian takeover. While it's to a great extent because of the will of Ukrainians to fight for their country, the importance of the external supplied platforms can't be overlooked. Transfer of systems like Bayraktar TV2, NLAWS, and HIMARS are playing a crucial role. After the initial delivery, 150 more Kirpi armored vehicles are expected to arrive in Ukraine in the near future. Kirpi's effectiveness has been proved in practice. Turkish land forces claim that the number of casualties has been reduced significantly since Kirpi was included in the military inventory. 
Currently, more than 200 of these have been successfully exported to several countries. Ukrainian armed forces have been good at utilizing the external platforms, and it remains to be seen how well they can leverage this Turkish armored vehicle. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting, and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.